my journey coming to Washington Township, I will say it was really challenging. I felt really lost. I came here when I was 15 and I moved from Venezuela. And the reason why we moved was because um, my parents got threatened by the government. So it was kind of like hit and run type of thing. So it was like a movie. At first it was challenging because I didn't know any English at all. So I communicated through Google Translator <laughs> and uh, I met a lot of teachers and I met uh, a lot of people that helped me just kind of like navigate the school grounds and I just started watching Friends and a bunch of Netflix TV shows and then by the end of my freshman year I presented my WIDA test and I I guess excelled and uh, I tried really hard to just kind of like absorb as much of the American culture as I could um, especially because since I had a really traumatizing experience when I got here I kind of like wanted to just forget about my past and that meant forget about my family and the things that I grew up with. And so I guess it prepares me because it makes me embrace every single challenge. And so um, it encouraged me to always keep fighting. I think North Central, my counselors, my teachers, they were all like, yeah, like you have this, but you still have to keep on fighting because College is still just around the corner and your dreams and all the things that you talked about so much, like you can achieve those. And they, I guess, never let me give up. And so I felt and I kind of like thought of them as family more than anything else. And I think that's something that I was looking for since I lost mine the moment I stepped into a plane and I came over here.